Yes, hello everybody. Hope you have an amazing day. Today's topic is about the tonsils, which are organs composed of aggregates of incompletely encapsulated lymphoid tissues that lie in of the initial portion of the digestive tract. The palatine, lingual, pharyngeal, and tubal tonsils, they form the valandized ring. Palatine tonsils are located in the lateral wall of the oral part of the pharynx. Their surface is covered by stratified squamous non cretinized epithelium, which forms deep crypts. All these areas are the deep crypts. And the resulting increase of the, of the surface area is one way to facilitate the contacts of antigen with the immune cells. The tonsils contain numerous of lymphoid follicles, which are, which are also called the lymphoid nodules with germinal center, which is the lighter part of the lymphoid follicle. There is also the lamina propria, which has a numerous of connective tissue, and the base of the tonsil, which is located on the lower part, there are blood vessels, there is also the salivary glands as well, and these all are located in the submucosal layer. And the base of the, of the tonsil, which is separated from underlying muscle by connective tissue, it's called the hemicapsule. This capsule acts as a barrier against spreading to of tonsillar infections. So for a quick recovery, there are the epithelium, the lamina propria, the lymphoid follicles, which you have the germinal center, which is the lighter part at the center. There, there are also the crypts, which are formed by the projections of the epithelial surface, which are very deep. Also, there are the muscle, muscle cells, which is the smooth type, the smooth muscle cells, they are also present, numerous of blood vessels and salivary glands as well, which are located in the submucosal area. So that is all for today and don't forget to like, subscribe and share all the videos and yeah, see you in the next video.